Welcome. This is Melinda Barlow, CZT, Certified Santangle Teacher, and today's lesson is eddy fur, or eddy paper, and it is a wonderful flowy tangle that I think you'll love the way it looks when you're finished, and it's just a fun, fun tangle. So let's get started with eddy fur. We'll zoom in a little on my, I'm just going to use a plain white tile and I am going to put a string on here and we'll see if I, what happens with, if I follow that string. And I'm going to use a PN pen today. This is a Micron pen. It has the plastic nib and it doesn't crush as easily as the 01 pen does and I really prefer this one. We're going to start out on our line and we're just going to come up make a spiral. So just an easy little spiral then come down on the side line draw lines to the point and voila you have a little spiral of paper or an eddy, a little twist of paper. We'll do another one, spiral in, draw your lines down, this one comes and stops there, and this one there, so that you have, had a little, it wasn't very dark pen, you have your little scroll of paper and you can just work this little tangle. It can have a holly bar effect. The more spirals you have in on your paper, the more twist it's going to have. You can see I'm just going right over my um, pencil line. Just giving it a little bit of a curve as I go around. Just following that little pencil line that I've drawn so that I can get my little, use my, oh, running right off the paper there. So there we have eddy fur. The spirals can go in either direction. Put one more in here. <coughs> and there we have eddy fur. And you can um, shade eddy fur. Put a little bit of graphite down here in the bottom. Just going to put it in the shaded spots where the it might look dark. So what I did is I put a little graphite down here at the bottom. Then in the bottom of each one of these little swirls where the paper might appear to have a shadow. And then blend it up so you can see that little curve a little bit more. Again I put here and you get that little look of that twist in that paper. I never worry about my pencil line. It will blend out. So I'm going to go ahead and put my color in 
and I can come back and just blend and blend and blend. I will like that. This particular one probably doesn't have as much dark as I prefer. So we could go in here and, and maybe add something that would have a little bit more. I don't know if I like that or... Just a few fescues. Maybe I want to darken up my line a little. Just the top of that. Sometimes I'll go back in and make a line a little darker. I like that. Weight it up a little so that I have a just a little bit more contrast I like that lots better so that it has it so this is Eddie Fur this one I like. I colored with uh, colored pencils. <clears throat> this one I'm just working on. I hope you enjoyed that tutorial. Eddie Fur could be a great tangle. Zoom out a little bit so you can see them. <clears throat> Enjoy Eddie Fur. It's a great wind or movement of a tangle that you can put about anywhere. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Share this video with your friends. Support for this channel comes from shopping at inkadoodles.com where you can get the PN pen in um, black, brown, burgundy, and blue individually. Thanks for watching and have a great day.